Are you serious? Are you serious? A huge sinkhole has just opened up in the intersection of Sunset Park in Brooklyn, New York. This happened about three hours ago. This, this sinkhole was not there. And a little after 7 a.m., a large sinkhole swallowed the entire intersection of Sunset Park intersection in Brooklyn, New York. The sinkhole developed uh, there at 5th Avenue and 64th Street. Are you serious? Uh, there's been no injuries, thank God. Uh, and it's not clear what caused it because there's no water. It's not like a, a water main broke. There's no water flowing. So they have no idea what would cause a sinkhole of this magnitude. But uh, once again, we're witnessing sinkholes opening up all over the world, all over the world, as the earth seems to be in, uh, literally pulling apart. Is hell enlarging itself and that without measure? Are you serious? Are you serious? I want you to get a scope and feel of how large this hole is. Let me just uh, scroll over here just a little. Check this out. Okay, there you see a person that's standing over there, which I don't know why that individual's standing there. Seriously, get away from there. You don't know how big this thing will end up being for it's over. It was not here three hours ago. Are you serious? So, and here's another, uh, on the other side of the street over here on the intersection, there's a car parked right there. <laughs> I'd be moving that. Uh, anyway, this is what's going on. Sinkholes opening up all over the world, folks. Something biblical is going on with the signs of the second coming of Christ. And you might say, Pastor, this is not a biblical issue. Yes, it is. I mean, if you read in the Old Testament, the sin of Korah. Uh, whenever they came against Moses and Aaron, and they said that they had fire that was, and they had a stronger anointing, and that they didn't need Aaron to be their priest. And Moses said, Meet me out front, outside the gate of the tabernacle, and bring your fire and your anointing oil. And they did. And Moses told them that this was an abomination of idolatry that they were trying to bring into the house of God. And the earth opened up and swallowed them all. Then a plague came through the land, killing thousands. And it was Aaron who had to run out ahead of the plague and put his staff into the ground to stop it. At least it wiped out the entire nation of Israel. Don't tell me God doesn't use sinkholes. He swallowed eight, the most eight expensive Corvettes in the world, right off the Corvette Museum's showroom floor, uh, in Bowling Green, Kentucky, a couple years ago, just before midnight, the, the earth opened up and swallowed the most expensive Corvettes in the world. Are you serious? We've seen sinkholes swallow villas in Florida, swallow people walking on the street in China, swallow fire engine in Indianapolis, swire, swallow cars in Chicago, uh, swallow a man in his bedroom sleeping. We've never found him again. He's just gone in Florida. This goes on and on and on and all over the world. Are you serious? Something's going on here, folks. I'm telling you, hell is enlarging itself. Hell is enlarging itself. And that without measure. Time is running out. Give your life to Jesus Christ, folks. He's coming soon. Don't look. I'm not looking for a hole in the ground. I'm looking for a home in the sky.